Hi, Cristian Hernandez here from the Cisco Tax Security Team. Today, I want to show you how to configure the TCP State Bypass in the Firepower 3 Defense version 6.3 and beyond by using the 3 Defense Service Policy. First, access your FMC UI and go to Objects and Object Management. Select Access List and create an extended access list to match the traffic to be bypassed. In this example, I create an access list called TCP-Bypass to match bidirectional TCP 3389 traffic between the host 10.2.2.20 and the 10.3.3.30. I highly suggest you to be very specific with the traffic matching this access list. This will avoid unwanted traffic to get bypassed. Once the access list is created, click Save to continue. After this, go to Policies. Select the FTD access control policy required. Then go to the advanced options for this policy. Scroll down and click over the pencil for the 3 Defense Service Policy option. Then configure the TCP state bypass by selecting Add Rule. Then choose the option Global for applying the TCP bypass rule globally in the FTD and click Next. Choose the TCP bypass access list we created and click Next. Then select Enable TCP State Bypass and click Finish. After this, you will see the global TCP bypass rule we created. Click OK to continue. Save the changes. And deploy it to the FTD. You can put a TCP bypass deployment node for tracking down the changes made to your FTD. Once the deployment is completed, go to the FTD CLI and run next commands to confirm the TCP state bypass configuration is in place. First, get access to the FTD system support diagnostic CLI. Hit enter when asking for password. It is not required. Run a show access list TCP bypass for checking the access list created. Run a show running config class map for checking the class map created. Run a show running config policy map for confirming the TCP bypass is globally applied. To ensure the traffic requires bypass, proceed to clear the connection related by running next command. After this, check the FTD connections and look for the lowercase v flag to confirm the TCP flow is bypassed. You have successfully applied the TCP state bypass in the FTD. Contact TAC support if you have any other issues and check the TAC video portal for more. Thank you.